Welcome to Mermaid Day 1. Fantasy begins here. I want to be a mermaid. On day one of Mermaid, I'm ready to see all the beautiful mermaids looking back at me. I see all these beautiful seashells, blue, pink, yellow, purple, and even lavender too. I see them all over the rocks and all the ground. I wonder why they're there and wonder why I can't see any mermaids yet. So I get closer and closer to the water. All I see is fish and dirty water. So I'm so happy I see all these seashells, all the different colors. They matter to me because maybe this is a secret of a mermaid life. I don't know. So today's a fun day for you and me. I hope you enjoy the very first day of Mermaid 2024. I see something floating in the water. I hope you enjoy this. Let the fantasy begin. This is day one. Have fun. <laughs> so are you ready for a sneak peek of some mermaids today i hope and pray you like everyone i show you today i'm having so much fun showing you these mermaids today i will be drawing the 31 or 32 mermaids each and every day each day will be a different story about different mermaids that i'm trying to draw but today it's all about i want to be a mermaid the story that started it all i love you guys so much thank you so much for watching this video give me a thumbs up like and subscribe. Don't forget to like this video and tell your friends all about Dee Dee's Crafts and Mermaid 2024. I hope you enjoy all these mermaids I've drawn so far. They're really cool and amazing and beautiful from each other. I love this so much. So let's get started on this video. Let's start sketching mermaids. You know what today is? Today is May 1st, 2024. You'll see all these videos probably in July or August because I'm behind on all my videos. And you'll see a lot of summer videos in August as well. So thanks for watching this video. Today is the very first day of Mermaid 2024. Thank you for watching this video. Give me a thumbs up, like, subscribe, and let's get started on this video. So the first drawing, I want to show you some several drawings I did draw for the very first day of Mermaid. The theme is I want to be a mermaid. So that's what it says right there, I want to be a mermaid. These are all the materials that I did use, these Crayola color pencils and these markers from Art Maker. I got it out of a kit from Manga, and she looks pretty cute. I like how she's drawn. I colored it in, and I think she's wonderful. I have some sketches I want to show you, so I won't keep you too long. I really have fun drawing this. It was it took forever to draw. I always say forever my artwork, but this is such a beautiful drawing. I love what the hair looks like. You know, the bottom of the hair right there could be helped a little bit more, but that's all right. Right here, this is like the area that really bothers me the most in the skin tone. So it was so much fun drawing this and creating this and getting this the way I want. The beautiful color of blue and the gray. Um, marker this marker right here is supposed to be this color i know it's like muted but that's what it's supposed to be i think most of the color just drained out of that marker i don't know that's how i bought it i use a crayola color pencils like i said i use this fine line right here that came with that kit over there and this is what i'm using for the color pencils so i'm so excited to show you this artwork so yay yay for artwork <laughs> so i hope you guys have a great great day um, i want to show you some sketches right um in this video for you guys that i did that i thought were cool and i got my trusty y'all pencil pouch that i got from five below in my beautiful keychain that i'm gonna make some of these myself so let me show you some sketches i did for this drawing that i thought were kind of cool so right here this is one of them she looks cute and sassy i'm gonna recolor this up you guys so she's what she looks like i like it her face looks totally different she's gonna have a thicker face her hair is totally different a little bit I changed it a little bit but i thought she looks great for the very first mermaid and i just retraced this over on some tracing paper i do have a light box but i didn't get it out so that's what this one looks like and then i did this one right here she's really cute and sassy i like her facial expression i like her hair right there i swoops over i think the hair's gotten better you guys i used to draw drawings that were terrible with hair so these are these are so much better the body even looks better i like the way the shape of the body looks i love everything about this drawing so this is a short 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 <laughs> short version of the same video i did i did a 19 minute video all about this the very first day that was way too long for me because it didn't look right so i mean i don't mind doing long videos if it don't look right it don't look right so this is what it looks like you guys um all three maybe i should get them all together like this so we can see them all three if i can get this correct see that's so cool you guys look all three look how pretty she looks and her color her color is kind of muted you know um so I'm trying to do a thumbnail, that's what I was trying to do, so that's why it looks like that. But let's show this like this. Those are the three. 
So comment down below which one do you like the best. Do you like the one right here with the little face and the hair, a little sassy little attitude, or this one who's kind of like <laughs> looking straight at you, or this one right here like it's looking like your our eyes are pierced, pierced at you. So it was so much fun drawing this and coloring this. This is just an amateur way of drawing, but I'm getting better. So I love this drawing. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Look at this one. I can't wait to curl this one up. I like how she looks. I like the face. I'm trying to get the eyes better. That's hard to do. And the nose. I'm trying to get the nose the way I want it. I'm trying to get my own drawing style. This I don't know what style this is, but and this, I guess it's my style since I'm drawing it. But I, I'm trying to draw my own way of drawing. I, I am going to re-ink these and color these up. So be, this will be day one. I'm working on day two, three, and four right now. So there will be a lot of mermaids coming up in the next couple of days. So thank you so much for watching the video, you guys. I want to talk to you at the end of the video. So I love these right here. I don't know if I'm going to use... um. Color pencils are not our marker. If I use marker over here and color pencil on this one, I use these markers right here, these markers on her hair a little bit and on her skin tone, that brown, that's really, really, really dark brown. She looks really pretty. I think the eyes got a little messed up, but, and I didn't ink it correctly, but that's okay. We'll learn how to ink better. So this is a cool drawing for you guys. Hopefully you like this video and I'll be back at the end of the video talking to you about mermaid. I just want to show you that I traced this beautiful artwork on tracing paper that I bought from Walmart. It was kind of cheap. It feels cheap. I have bought tracing paper before from Dollar Tree and they're kind of cheap too but I bought from Michael's Hobby Lobbies and I thought to myself I want to try this out and yeah, this looks so cool. Look at 3D, 2D art. Look at it. It's so amazing. This one looks like up close and personal you guys. I didn't trace it the best but that's okay. We're just learning how to do that again because I haven't traced it in a long time. I do have a light box. I have four light boxes actually you guys because I thought at one time I didn't have one so this is so cool um I have a light box from Amazon that costs like 17 or 25 dollars before the inflation set in <laughs> and then I bought one from Dollar Tree for like five dollars in the five dollar section and then I bought one from Sam's Club for 18 to 20 dollars and then I bought one for five below for five dollars and they look cute the summer small summer big summer exciting to use I have not used them really yet but I will be using it very soon. So I thought to myself, I'm going to get my tracing paper out and trace this. This looks so cute with my color pencils and my um my um, two um, drawing pencils that I got. So let me show you what this paper feels like. This looks, you know, it looks cheap. This is what it looks like right there, right there you guys. And I'm going to move these, these markers and color pencils. This is what it looks like close together. I did not trace it very well, as I said before. But she, <laughs> she looks so cute, right? I love it. So yay. I can't wait to do this again. And that's why I just want to show you how that looks. Kind of like. Look at that 3D look. Kind of like that. I like how it looks. So I like tracing paper. People don't like tracing things anymore. But I love it. So that is so cool, right? And then um, I think I'm going to show you one more thing and we'll be done with this video, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Have fun um, drawing and creating your mermaids. And you'll see this video probably in July or August, you guys. I'm way behind. I'm doing a lot of summer videos. But you can draw mermaids any time of the year. So I'll be right back, you guys. I'm going to show you a few more things. And... Uh, the drawing I drew for 2020, as you can see, it says, I want to be a mermaid. It says May 2, 2020. And she looks cute and sassy. I had her draw, draw her because I didn't like the hair. And I like the colors. The colors look cool. The pretty blues and purples and reds. I just didn't like how I utilized this, this drawing and how I could have made it better. So it was so hard to draw this one. And this was took me forever to draw and this paper was cheap it was copy paper i should have drawn copy paper never draw a copy paper paper you guys can talk over here this is actually drawing paper over here this is what i got but this is copy paper so i did it over i thought to myself mm, i don't like how this looks and I, I didn't like the hair i didn't like how the arms were not the same size the eyes were not the same and the, i didn't like how the tails i just didn't like anything about this at first i thought oh this is the greatest one ever like nah nah this is not good you guys you can tell that the hair looks all weird and i don't know what i was doing the hair so I thought to myself we got to do better than this drawing so I did, did this one instead so this is what it looks like right here the tracing paper gone but this one doesn't look that bad I like the hair looks a lot better the body looks a lot better I just don't like the coloring because I'm not good at good using coloring I'm using coloring not using <laughs> I'm not good at using um alcohol markers that's why this looks terrible in my opinion and the ink is a little off but not as bad as it is over here so yeah I had fun drawing this I had fun um drawing both of these actually I'm gonna keep this drawn for a memento as I said in the past how I um see how I drew in the back in the day see how terrible I actually was <laughs> but it's not that bad I've seen worse drawings than this and I've drawn worse than this so I said to myself you know that's okay. So let's show you something to the end of the video and we're all done, you guys. And this love it. Day did you like day. it? Do you enjoy day one of Mermaid? This is a shorter version of the one I just did. So you can watch both versions of these and decide. All the rest of my videos will be shorter than this. It'll be five minutes or less. So I had so much fun showing you all these cute little mermaids. I did draw for my own personal 
stash of markers and color pencils and love how it turned out. I'm still learning how to draw, still learning how to create things. I'm getting a lot better, I think so. I love the trace version over here. Look how cute she looks. And I love how they all look different. I made them all different on purpose. So this was so much fun drawing this and calling this in there. I can't wait to get my better, I can't wait to get better at my, <laughs> at my drawing style. I cannot wait to get better. This is, you guys have no idea what this means to me. So I had so much fun drawing, drawing this. This should be a good thumbnail, shouldn't it? This should be pretty good. I don't know, but thank you so much. Have a great day and I can't wait to talk to you more in my next video and more, more mermaids are coming. So keep crafting no matter what.